Hey everyone, it's Pankosis here, and I've got a new video for everyone. Now, this is a Ryzen This is a new Naruto game. It's been out for a little bit now, but like, it's very quite kind of hidden. Like, nobody really sees this game or anything. And so, some people may get a little confused sometimes on games. I mean, this game, so a lot of people don't like Naruto games because they like the Naruto TV and the way they all play out. This game plays somewhat similar, but also not exactly. So I'm just gonna show around a little as I'm also grinding. I'm B rank at the moment. I need to get this so I can prestige or to S rank. But um, so just gonna show. This is a house right here, as you can see the yellow. I don't mind that. But um, this yellow house right here, this or this little market, this is like a home. So there's three. There's the houses, which is these that you can like buy and you can live in and such you can you if you get enough money you can start buying stuff in there i'm kind of poor right now but um so that's pretty good then there is the general house or general store where you can buy stuff from which is like i don't know ours is different and then there's a blacksmith house so general store is where you can sell items and stuff so i'll explain that now in a second and blacksmith is for blacksmiths to make weapons uh this is my friend right here don't mind him, uh, he's just chilling, don't mind him too much. But I'm gonna quickly show the skill tree to what if people are all confused. But this is kind of like health and such, the Anahata. I'm just gonna go quickly through this because there's so many study guys in this video, there's no real content to it too much. I mean, even I can't do it. But this is dodging, sprinting, ninjutsu. I personally, my friend recommended me to go this way because it's so awesome. Kenjutsu for sword. Um, taijutsu. If you do end up going to Taijutsu and you take Taijutsu Novice or you take Boxing, you cannot go this route. Just letting you know that if you, if you realize. But blacksmithing to make weapons, cooking so you can make food, tailor so you can make items, like you can make two pouches, leg weights, you can make outfit or accessories. But I think this is one of the hardest ones to get in the game right now because it's so expensive. Like, that is a little too much right there, especially this one, the Book of Poison. Because it's so much TP, and like you get one TP per like rank, level up. Because, I mean, it takes ranking. The thing is, ranking obviously is like a couple TPs before you get it, so some can be like 20 TP, 30 TP before you actually get there. But, um, so what you want to do is, when you start the game especially, because I'm just going to help you a little, for everyone, get a fishing rod and fish maybe for a little. That I would say, or literally just mine. Mine, get a lot of stuff. You can get ores and stuff. Ores are for blacksmiths, so if you can give them that, that helps. So if your friends want, that's really good, or if you're one. But like the emeralds and such, you can sell. But the best thing you can do, get a plow and a water can. I'm in Stone Village right now. Stone is like, in my opinion, one of the best villages right now. Like, they're one of the zestiest or like fruitiest villages right now. But like, every other village likes to kill each other the whole time. Cloud's also quite chill though, I believe. So let me just, yeah, If you, the more HP you have, the far, further you go, so that works for me. But from the entrance, which is over there, if you come this way, there's planting over there. You get a plow and a water can from him. You go over, you plant. Now when you get five, five, fiber, cannot speak. You press M, you get three fiber, you put it in here, and you get cloth. Now, get as much cloth as you can, craft, just click craft all, and then go to Sand Village, and you can sell it. Now, okay, I won't show all the way to Sand Village and such, but the way it works is there's a, la a place called the Land of Hunt, where events happen, which is between all the villages, basically, because the map has been split all into villages and the Land of Hunt. So you want to go to the, la want to go through the Land of Hunt, go all the way to Sand Village, the best way I can explain is there's a sand dummy there. Also, just be careful, you jump over, when you go over here, jump over the over these so when you hit here just jump over this just saying otherwise you will fall through but um yeah when you see a dummy that's when you know you're getting the right way so you just go past the dummy and you should be fine with that but then yeah you just you plow the ground you press m you go in your inventory you place the seeds let me just use a bowl of ramen real quick but then yeah that's how uh, because cloth sells for like four or five they yeah, four i think um five burning cells for one per piece so not really worth it if you're confused on your clan, can check clan or settings, or not settings, stats, my bad. Because here you can see, I am a Uchiha. My Mangekyo Sharingo just got recently changed, so it was that's confusing. I'm going to be doing this row right at the moment. That's my goal at the moment. But, um, for 
people who are confused because there's some people confused about eyes and stuff. Byakugan, I believe, is perth or you have to guard break people until you get it. And you can press it, get it by pressing H. I've got you, as you can see, one Tomo. But um, to get Sharingan, you just have to get knocked. Once you get knocked enough, you'll be fine. And then Tomos, the way to progress Tomos is by slaughtering other players. If you just kill other players, you can have a pretty good chance of getting it. Which is what actually I need to eventually start doing. Bit of a pain, but it's going to be worth it eventually for me. Because I mean, yeah, the Uchi is really terrible right now, so if you do want to reroll it, don't blame you. Because Mangekyo has it, we have no clue how to get it, so... No real point at the moment for it. But yeah, get a house and everything. I do say though, because people also complain about the close communities. I'm a rogue ninja. I can just farm the game and I get TP and I'm fine. I don't have to worry. You get five times TP plus will blazing on. It is faster if you're part of a village because the thing is, the only reason a lot of people complain is because of the exams. Because you have to do gaining exams, tuning exams, journey exams to get through the game. I'm not sure if training is exactly in game, but yeah, so you gotta do those. Then once you do those, you can do missions. Each one has their own missions, they're more harder and they give well, like more XP obviously and such. But um yeah, so that's one of the biggest points in this game. Well, absolutely. You need to do that and then once you have enough for um so no, once you have enough TP you can prestige from S rank. You can put it to points. If you're going ninjutsu, I one hundred percent go this one. Because before it was the level up thing, you see all affinity. So if I do, that's also another thing. When you press Z, you can do these. So you see two, one, two, three. So you have to press just slay people now. now. See, I use Phoenix Flower. Everything gets done. Yeah, I put myself in combat, but you can hurt yourself though. But um, yeah, very cool, very interesting. But also, if someone wants to teach you, they have to type in chakra seals. And then every single, they have to just type in dragon seal, horse seal, ox seal, stuff like that. And just teach you them one, all the way through, one to zero. It's a bit of pain, like, for example, two, one, one, two, one, three, two, one. There we go. That's flamethrower, okay, that takes way more stuff, obviously. But yeah, every single one is different, of course. Some are harder, maybe there's harder. It's not better for beginners, so the Finn's Blower is way better. You can transfer your suit to your scroll. Yeah. If you do have questions, uh, let me know. I can make a starter guide as well. There is a lot of starter guides in this game. But if you guys want to throw on one, explain everything in the game, I can. But that's kind of just a short little clip. I've mainly been fishing this entire time. I'm in the kitchen. My friend's farming, I'm fishing. That's how we get going right now. Very nice, very just chill out. But, um, so I'm gonna quickly switch the trailer and I'll explain from there a little bit more. Right. So, three, three, two, one. Alright, there we go. So that's just the, yeah. this is the trailer. So this, okay, just gonna explain these now. So there's fl fire, wind, earth, I don't know what rice paddies is to be honest. And then a hand for the show, talking about, and then cloud. Now there's, so, just explain a little bit, tailors, or oh, let's go to blacksmithing quickly because that's the easiest one right here. So blacksmithing, that's, you get the books, the books teach you different ones, here, hatchet, pickaxe, but nine healed, small blade, so then you can make these. This one, just saying, is namakaze, I'll explain that now in a second. Light weapons and such, medium weapons, and heavy weapons. There's obviously more weapons in the game, just not everything's on here. Um, so you can make those, tailors, they make all of these. This one you can't get, this is the sound, and I mean, oh yeah, Bryce Paz is sound. However, sound is locked at the moment, no one else can join just yet, as far as I know at least. General books, these are general. Don't get these to be honest, don't get any general books, just get someone else to teach you. Next thing over, obviously, is the styles, there's water, when you get chakra paper, you can see your main one, obviously. But the thing is, you can get all the others. I am literally in, oh, I have earth, but I use fire and wind, so. Let's go into, I guess, clans quickly, it's just so, it's just a brief thing so I can explain to some people. So, confused, Sharing Gun, obviously, Abaram is the, uh, what's it, not the ants, but the bugs in general, so they get all these, they get a lot. 
the gets eight gates. I'm just explaining because as soon as he gets two moves, I think the burial and the missiles. Yeah, Hugo, you know Byakugan. Who doesn't know Byakugan? Senju is like one of the best clans I think right now, though, especially. Like it's such a good combo. Kage is also really good. They get a free light weapon, so if you got light weapon or you get the clan, go light weapon is pretty good. Number Kaze as well because you know I explained this Raijin Kunai. The move costs like 30 TP, I believe, but you can just TP with it and you can TP. So if someone comes for you, you can just TP away. Akamishi, they get a mode, so you can see here. I prefer this is also one of the best clans, I think, in my opinion at least. Wait, literally a bird. Hoshigaki. Uh, you don't really see it too often, it's not too too bad though. Chinoke is probably the best eyes, I think, apart from Byakugan right now. Which yeah, is definitely the worst. Hoki is pretty good, they got new M1s as well. Pretty good combos. Shogun is also pretty good. Because then M1s and such. Hatake, a lot of people don't always diss this one because they never do anything good for Kakashis, but the passive is yeah, purple lightning, which does more damage, and you get extra TP, which is amazing. Hatake, I'm not too sure. Nara is your yeah, shadow, so. To get that, that's pretty good, I believe it stuns. And Sartobi is also, I don't think, bad. But, yeah, as far as I know, though, as well, with so Sartobi, just to explain, I believe Sage Scrolls are in game. I'm not too sure because only a little bit I know about it is in the game right now. So that's the only problem I have with it. But that, I think, is kind of the rest. Alright, there we go. Back again here. Now. Um, I think the thing is though, I've just explained also this game because a lot of people just don't really know about it And it's actually such a fun and interesting game, especially with friends. If you got friends, absolutely play this 100% This is a good game with friends Just the last two things I want to note is for people who are confused uh, If you have money, go get wave. It's like 400 robux pretty cheap compared to a lot of games If you can't wait for wave event, they happen like twice a day they happen for me at like 1 a.m. and like 6 p.m. roughly, which is GMT plus 2, so if you can figure that out, that's all you. But, um, yeah, so that happens also as well. Just make sure you have joined the group and the Discord server. I'll link the Discord and the game in, in, by, along with uh, the group. So there's all three links right there for you. Just you need to read what people did in the channel wave event for that. And do note, they, wait, when you get like enough TP, it will pop up with a screen on the left or like... Oh, do you want to change your strength? Do you want to change your chakra? Like, how do you want to do it, right? Do note, with that comes along also a lot of other things, such as, like, how do I explain it? How do I explain it? Well, yeah, when you die or you get gripped, you lose some of those. It's horrible. I think strength is the one you lose the most. I'm not sure. I'll make another video on the game, obviously. I'll try and put some more content out because, I mean, I can't show much just yet. I mean, I can show you kind of what a house looks like. That's the best I can do. Or oh, I can't really. I can can, but like I would have to swap quickly. Cause you I mean you go and change things and stuff. Just remember that. So let me just do that real quick and show you the house real quick. That's it. All right, there we go. We're inside. So yeah, I'm kind of just doing this as quick for you, so this wouldn't be too too long, I guess. But uh, as you can see, by carpet and such, desk, storage one here, room kitchen so everything is just kind of buy and then you leave stuff like that if you have this part is like gray and you can't heal it you have to go on a bed like this i think that is pretty much it though to self to get even self-explanatory from then on uh i think that is it though uh so thank you guys for watching please like and subscribe and help me out here to grow my channel a bit more please share also to your friends and such if you do need help, just go in the comments or DM me on Discord. You can do either. But uh hope to see you all in the next video. Uh see you later my see you later guys.